games. This game sucks. We should play Phantom Breaker again. Continue that. Joseph Stalin. Wow. That is a fun, fun fact. Welcome back to Souls of a Submarine. Oh, God, I hope this is it. I, I hope, hope this... so, too. I was just telling Colobacter that um, Joseph Stalin's granddaughter runs a antique shop in Portland, Oregon. And for that matter... Um, Daily Flicker, September the 11th, 1935. Gorbachev, whatever his name was. ABC affair, I... Terminus Don Casta, Jap and Poirot, arrest the killer. In California. A because is the name is of the alphabet murderer. Oh. The police have oh. arrested him in a hotel in Doncaster. In was preparing to kill well, his hey, fourth I mean, victim, Mr. Dick Dudley <laughs> Donbar, the establishment yeah, yeah, manager. That's, that's true, that's Mr. True. Donbar I mean, the owes his life to, to the miraculous intervention of Inspector Chap of Scotland Yard uh, and Detective right? Hercule Poirot. <laughs> <laughs> Anywhere? <laughs> Oh, the that was good. September. All right. How, uh, I don't care. But, uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm answering the phone now, Poirot. Oh, wait, no. Can you look the mirror again? No, I'm look. I'm answering the goddamn phone. Chief okay. Inspector, is that you? Yes. Sorry, but we haven't found yes. anything. Oh, who so else did you to typewriter? Poirot. And the packaging, the letter, and the rhythm reel. We've only found prints left by Cust and his landlady. Well, never mind. I shall make do. Sometimes it's so. Uh, are quiet. you still going to hold your yeah, meeting? That is true. Of yeah. course, Chief Inspector. Oh, I can hear my guest who, coming um, up the stairs. Called him and was like, "Or no." Why have you brought us here, Mr. Poirot? Where the fuck did Since they come Custer, from? They all was all done and dusted. Now he's, you know, telling Miss Griff only identified him, as well as Miss Barnard. Isn't here? Yes. Do you remember who and the, the stockings he saw are the same Maybe brand as the ones found at my aunt's. That dude. I think this it is, is among them. However, a case is not closed if some questions remain open. And one question is, why did the murderer send me his letters? Why did he challenge me, Hercule Poirot? Perhaps he wanted to play with you, to taunt you. Xenophobia? Maybe he didn't like you because you're foreign. <laughs> Speak for yourself, Hastings. Um, I may be oh, wrong, but Hastings. maybe oh, by provoking Hastings. you, he was looking for glory. All these theories should be studied. No, no let's just... Let us now try and get our brain cells to work. Oh, almost... Can we just question everybody and get the goddamn thing done? Wait, but I thought we ended up at the races. What's... What? Uh... Did the murderer make a mistake with the address? All right. Piece of an envelope with the wrong address. Live arrived late. Uh, what? What? No, that's it is sense. well known. Um. <clears throat> okay. Why? No, it's why did he make it? All right. So maybe it's those two, but then. Um. There we go. Yeah. Okay. The mistake is intentional. Why did the letters send, or why did the killer send his letters to her Poirot? Yes, no. because he's xenophobic. Uh, Poirot Glory. No. Superiority complex. No. The body is. So <laughs> <more>. <laughs> I wanted that to be it. Well, like. It's gotta be one of. Wait. What? Is everything clear no. now? No. Hmm. You might like to explain your reasoning again. Of course. First of kill all, remember now. that the murderer made it a rule Just to always post now. his letter before the murder. No, come on. Anyway, he never I, I was on pretty sure that this episode ended with them However, in Chester, like he the encountered a problem. Race. The village has only oh, 500 in, inhabitants. In, 
some place that started with a D. It would be oh, easy and like, to arrest yeah, him. Doncaster. And Therefore, like, the murderer delayed his letters deliberately with the wrong address. The plan is. wouldn't have worked if he'd sent it to Scotland Yard or the also, papers because everybody really knows their addresses. The mistake would have been oh, corrected and later would yes. have been on time. At the same time. That is why the murderer chose me as the recipient. It looks like a thousand times better than this piece of shit that they call a game. Because for his plan to succeed, it was necessary game. for at least one of the letters to have a wrong address and get lost. It was very cunning. Absolutely. It is a very subtle plan. It matches so the profile we have drawn up of him perfectly. That of an subtle intelligent, like daring and calculating murderer. Sorry, what? No, but Oliver, you shouldn't have made that That's not how you joke. describe cast. That was not a good idea. You are quite right, mademoiselle. Like you, I find it hard to believe that this dull character is the clever murderer we are looking for. Yeah, do you mad and his dull penis. I'm Oliver, I don't, seriously, what are you if doing? He's mad, I don't think he that might it have ended two at the very horse different races. Sides. I think you're thinking, mixing it up with something No else. doubt. Okay. But the murderer is not mad. Maybe All the specialists agree that he does not have the profile of a psychopath. Maybe in the episode, but if Cast is not guilty, how do you explain his Maybe. presence at the scene of the crime? We've seen a lot of episodes. Mr. Clark, the answer to your question Clark, is in the medical records of your brother's patients. Documents which Cast most certainly did not have same. access to. They got real lazy. Let us now try or and get our brand sales to work. To hire actual voice actors. These well, are probably yeah. the developers, to be perfectly honest. Well, yeah, because Paro is fucking horrible. All right, uh, what do we know about him? Um. Nope. Cuss tries to overcome his... Well, that's not true. Yeah, so he's easily influenced? I don't know. Wait, okay. What do we know about him? There's a lot of... Murder found a way to access Dr. Clark's medical records mm -hmm. and tried to burn No, him. that's not it. Cust... Oh, wait. Cust was wounded during, during the war. war. We know that about him. He was, was in the war, but was never quite the same after. I mean, it could. It could literally be anything. How about uh, easily influenced, like the first one? Uh. I don't know. I don't care. Okay, I hope everybody doesn't mind. We're just gonna start this game. <laughs> all right, all right. So we're gonna Ugh, just start at the fuck top. This, fuck this. He's easily influenced. No. 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 <laughs> no. Uh, no. Hey! Oh wow! I don't even know what that one was. <laughs> Let's look. Uh, wounded during the war. Wounded Easily influenced. Okay. Yeah, because why not? Yeah, sounds uh, good. How to explain Cus's presence at the Who crime scene? Who cares? He was a door-to-door -door salesman. Uh, I would also say that he is easily influenced, but I guess you know, my no, he, opinion he doesn't want... matter. No, it's no, it's going to be the uh, swim. The swim? The one, the back cell. He wanted to go to the back cell because he wanted to swim. Oh. Damn it! Fuck me. Just, okay, start playing that game. All right. Playing the game. No, I, I really don't think it's going to be that one. Well, it is. we're I'm gonna... playing the game of eliminate literally everything. Oh, uh, yeah, fair enough. All right, so now we take that one down and we do yep. this. It, I'm, you're just gonna, I'm just going to do it anyways, just to be sure. Well, you're wasting time on I'm that. I'm not wasting that much time. Cause you could start at. Yeah. Okay. There is a method to this madness. Yeah, hey. and you're doing the method wrong. Cool. I also really does don't Dr. like Dr. Clark's that, you know, records the camera provided a very useful like, list of potential victims. Yeah, it wasn't all that much. But they didn't get to read the killer definitely used it. I don't fucking care anymore because the they do shit the like that. I just don't fucking the care. The care. It uh, is this fact that kill he is cast once and for all because he never With had those, access to these that, records. That uh, blanks loaded revolver. So how did he happen to be at the scene of the crimes? Anyways, is that the murderer sent him there, or Cus was that, following um, him closely? I kind of want to know what the Cus' highly suggestible is. nature leads us to the second hypothesis. This, no, it's Stalin. It's the murderer was manipulating him. <laughs> he systematically sent Cus to the towns the where Gandhi he was going mustache. to strike, Ga so that the suspicion mustache? would land on the poor man's shoulder. That's evil. 
What sort of killer could have such a plan? And what would he gain from three completely different murders? Indeed, it seems unlikely that the same murderer committed all the crimes. What should we take from that? Oh, Jesus. That's a lot. So either there are three murderers. There's one murderer. Oh, right. This is it. Say that just one murder is of interest to the killer. Yes. Just one murder was of benefit to the murderer. The others were just diversions. On reflection, there is only yes. one conclusion. The murderer killed oh. once part Power. of the interest and twice to divert our attention. Speed. This reasoning and points out two potential culprits. Franklin Clark. Donald Fraser? Wait, but there are yes, the rooms. Yes, That's good thinking. Or the room. Mr. Fraser may have killed Betty out of jealousy. Mr. Clark may have killed his brother in order to inherit his large fortune. But they're Both right here and you're saying it in front of them. But yeah. Donald did not have access to Dr. Clark's records. Yeah. Please allow me to disagree with you, mademoiselle. <laughs> right next to him. Oh my god. I think Donald was treated by Dr. No. No, that was... It was um, his firm. Donald's firm worked for Clark? <sighs> Decay... Was resting at church. Maybe he was. Ooh. I don't remember. This is going way too far back. He works for Court and Brunskill, one of whose clients was Sir Carmichael. Okay, sure. It doesn't prove that I went to Combside. You could have done it, could and have, you may have used the opportunity to take a look at but Sir Carmichael's didn't. record. Yeah, yeah. You think I'm guilty? You think? Uh, you think? Oh, I Mr. Franklin Clark. That's ridiculous. Both of you have a motive. The question is, which of you has the profile that now most resembles the murderer? Now let's get cells to work. Seriously. Let us now try God and get how... <sighs> I'm sorry. You're fine. Is Donald... is Donald clever? No. Megan really likes Donald Frazier. <laughs> <laughs> let's see. Uh, I'm going to doubt myself. Wait, that's the wrong accent. Book. <laughs> uh, he's a bright man. Off scene. Well, women seem to like him. I sleep on the train. I, I like, like trains. trains. <laughs> it's easy to sleep, rocked by the sound of the wheels. Poirot. All right, let's play this game. All right, this is an easy one, at least. <laughs> There we go. Which one was it? I don't know. <laughs> Something. Who fucking uh, cares? No, I do care. I want to know. He was a bright man. <laughs> oh, okay. So he is clever. All I mean, right. he's a drunk, but whatever. Is he sure of sure himself? Sure of himself. Uh, no. No. Easy to influence. That seems to be the opposite of sure of yourself. Is he a seducer? I'll sleep I'll on sleep the, tra all the trains. <laughs> <laughs> Is Donald like trains? I sleep on the trains. <laughs> Is Donald impulsive? Oh my god. Oh man. Megan really <laughs> likes Donald Frazier. <laughs> He's quick tempered. Oh god. Whoops. Fuck. <laughs> Okay, good. Is Donald generous? He would have made a good husband. Because he likes trains. Because he, he likes to sleep on Ladies trains. and gentlemen, Donald may share many character traits with the murderer, but he does not have his cold indifference. He has a temper. Oh, it is hard to imagine him planning anything. Also, jealousy is his motive, and crimes of passion yes. are rarely right. planned. Let's can't end it, we'll split this episode. Right, I suppose it's my turn to be subjected Probably, to the same um, scrutiny. After this yes, absolutely not, Mr. Clark. you have the same voice actor as Sir Michael or Franklin Let us now try and get yeah, our Yeah, I think uh, if we can't finish this in a reasonable amount of time, we'll cut here. All right, is Franklin clever? Or is evasive about, his relate about her relationship with him? Uh, according to the teachers... But lack discipline. Sure. He's clever. Very clever. Is he sure of himself? Yes. He's fallen in. Jesus. Come on, Poirot. I'm a married man. 
Captain Wait, Hastings. This is, this is Captain Hastings. <laughs> Obviously. Uh, nope. No. All right, uh, we'll go with this one. Yeah, the long text. He's self-confident. Is he sure? Is he a seducer? Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. What? Well, fuck you. Yes, do that one. Damn it. Damn. Come on, Poirot. What? That how made, is, that how made... is Hastings being, inf you know... That made... Mis oh, whatever. That made no sense. Does he like trains? I like to sleep Does on... Does he like to sleep on <laughs> trains? <laughs> sure, why not? Damn uh... it. Uh... Hey, he likes trains. He likes to sleep on trains. <laughs> Is Something's... he impulsive? Nope. Calculated. Is Franklin generous? Well, we had two options and I got it wrong. 50-50 shot. As you have all seen, oh, there is man, a disturbing so similarity so between Mr. Close. Clark's profile and that of the over. killer. In actual oh. fact, it is exactly the same. Shut up. Come on. Mr. Poirot, your on. psychological Come studies are interesting, but your conclusions do not add up. Why would I have wished my brother's death? Money. The inheritance is lawfully mine. I just have to wait. Money. No, you had to act quickly. Oh. Say that Thor... Franklin was impatient or Thor bothered him. I don't remember. He's impatient. He doesn't because care about women. Because you are incapable women. of waiting. Really? Well, I am no murderer. You presented him as being a cold and patient schemer. Oh, fuck. Hmm, cert. Normalement. But Lady Clark's imminent death precipitated events. Mademoiselle, also you haven't been telling the truth. What? There Whatever. is no doubt in my care. mind that you would have yeah. found a way to Fuck marry Sir scary. Carmichael Spoiler alert. after Spoiler Lady Clark's alert. death. It was Franklin Clark. For you, Spoiler Mr. Clark, alert. it was a disaster. <laughs> if Miss Grey had cheated on by your brother, you would not Spoiler have visited the thing. Poirot's you realize the, the danger also, after reading several letters from Comsai, Donald Fraser especially one is, uh, in which your brother opened his well, to you. He likes to so you hurried on from China, trains. and you took action. The sound of the wheels. In truth, Kirst was no more than a puppet so manipulated by the real so culprit. You, Mr. Clark. Such an imagination, Mr. Poirot. Uh, in fact, nobody manipulated uh, Kirst. The you. famous instructions he received fuck by post. Game. He wrote them on the typewriter. We know that for sure. Oh, do we? Make sure oh, no. you are drinking you know plenty while watching well. this because goddamn, this game is horrible. Eh bien, voilà. Light has what now been shed on the ABC murders. I don't know. Your theories are ingenious, but you haven't any proof. You have not any One proof. One point to him. For the moment, I have no material proof. Either I admit to it, or I bluff. Oh. Ooh. Invent an item of proof. Lie about fingerprints found on... No, that's not going to work. No, I think you should. No, it's not going to work. I think you should. Is that what he does? Uh, I don't think so. Oh, God. I think so. I think it's what he does. Okay, I'll do it. Hang on, hang on. Do you want me to check? Yes, check. All right. What does he do? We're looking up the episode. Well, I think I'm looking up the synopsis of the book itself. Well, yeah, that. I hope this isn't copywritten. Franklin laughs off Poirot's claims, but panics when Poirot states that his fingerprint was found okay. on Cus' typewriter key. One Bam. thing puts it. The prints you left on Cus' typewriter. Oh. Enough. Oh, of course, you wiped the typewriter before sending it. But not carefully enough. Scotland Yard has found your print along with those of Cust. I understand why you never wanted to lend me your new typewriter. And why you were searching through your brother's things. And this the hole so you dug on the moors. What did you hide yeah. there? Oh, the knife you enough. used to kill so your brother? Boring. Enough. Game, set, match. You win, Mr. Wow, Poirot. that was easy. Wow, but it that was, was worth trying. Wait, so why did I have the gun? Why did Poirot have Hastings with... Oh. 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 Don't come near me. Damn it. If only we had put real... I'll never let you in. take me, Mr. Poirot. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> ha ha ha. 
So you're just going to have a rupture to your drum, bitch. Yeah, so going to hang for your crime. I'm sorry, Mr. Clark, there is no easy death for you. I expected your reaction, so I used blanks. <laughs> Why, if we didn't put on... I'm sorry, yeah. mademoiselle, but your second yep. chance has been lost. Yep. Franklin Clark yep. will never inherit yep. his brother's fortune. Oh. Should have gone for the Stalin stash. Stalin stash would have been the best stash. So bushy. I think we're No, I think we end. made the right choice, though. Look at those cloned guards. Yep. Like, were they twins? Or, sorry, police officers. Uh, Disappointed at having missed the chance cares. to become Lady Clark, Thora Gray uh. left England. Oh, good for her. She got drawn onto a picture of the... Donald <laughs> Fraser and Meghan yep. Barnard married. Good for them. Yay. I'm glad. Not really. I don't care. On Poirot's recommendation... Mary Drower started to work for Lady Clark. Lovely. The elderly lady's condition suddenly took a turn for the better. My oh. mind. It's as if she was being And a few months later, to Dr. Logan's great surprise, she was back on her feet again. According to this Wait, eminent physician, it appears to be an extremely rare talking? case of spontaneous remission. I don't know. Lady when did Clark he come has in? enjoyed very know. good health ever since. What? Who the fuck is this dick dude? Oh, he's a dick. <laughs> Journal uh, of an Innocent yeah, The Incredible Story of ABC game. As for A.B. Cust After being advised by Poirot He made a great deal of money By selling his story to the press Oh good And as for me I like with the business booming the Black Swan has become the number one tourist attraction in the whole of Yorkshire. By the way, I like to sleep on Even trains. More popular I think than it's York Donald. Minster. No, because it says Dick Donbar. That's not Donald's name. And he even referenced, he said Donald was like, oh, they married. I like to sleep on trains. I train. like to sleep on trains. Oh, thank God. Based on the novel. Oh, my God. Of my Clyde's production. Oh, this game was horrible. A Newman Interactive. C-A-C-A-O Stefan Longer Deputy C-A-O <laughs> Sandra oh, Ragobert Fuck me, JP, I hated this game Production Executive Producer Elliot Grassagna Fuck, I can't keep up Oh Marketing god I don't Come know why people wanted it. us to continue But we're done We're so done, we're everything's done, done. Not I even missed 100 and 32. 32 ego points and I give a shit. Thank you all for watching. I'm gonna go have another drink now. Good night. Drown our sorrows. Oh, fuck me.